There are over 1.1 billion people without access to potable drinking water. While water filtration devices have been developed to resolve this problem, they have all experienced issues impeding their effective integration into the third world. Most significantly, every current filter has encountered problems in marketing and establishing sustainable small businesses to provide these filters. In an attempt to decrease the mortality rate and improve the quality of life in the third world, the Ceramic Enclosed Sand Filter, or CESF, was created to overcome these issues and take a step into the sustainable future for third world water filtration. CESF is a modification of sand filtration, wherein a kiln or manure-fired ceramic body encloses two layers of sand or denutrient soil, and beneath them, two respective thin layers of cloth or hessian to prevent the grain's progression. Water is poured into the input reservoir, passing through a minimum depth of 60 centimeters of granules at a flow rate of approximately 20 to 40 litres per hour, and finally collecting in the lower reservoir. When the lower reservoir reaches maximum capacity, a specially curled lip on one side of the perimeter directs the overflow into a stream which can be safely captured in a drinking vessel without the risk of recontaminating the lower reservoir. CESF can achieve a bacterial filtration rate of 95 to 99 percent while only requiring minimal maintenance once approximately every four months over a minimum expected lifetime of one to two years. Furthermore, depending on environmental conditions, CESF can be equipped to filter heavy metals or oil, with the addition of charcoal or hair placed under the first 5 centimeters of sand. This may prove advantageous during emergency relief after a flood, water poisoning, or an oil spill, to which the filter can be quickly mass-created on the ground without the need of specialized machinery, and while only needing to use abundant local resources. While the filter could be created without charge to any person with access to sufficient clay resources, is designed to be quickly and easily integrated into a small village business. The skills required to create ceramic artifacts are common local knowledge in many third world villages. Thus, the filter can be easily constructed within the intended village by exploiting pre-existing skills. This also greatly increases the design's integration into a small village business to provide a reliable supply of filters to the community. To improve the likelihood of success of such businesses, the design can be artistically decorated and externally manipulated to produce an aesthetically pleasing and unique filter. In so doing, the competitively priced filter will not become a product for the poor, rather a family centerpiece which draws attraction from its external appearance. This is done to dramatically increase the design's marketability and integration into a greater percentage of third world homes than any current filter has achieved.